Aloha, everybody, and thank you for joining us this evening for Pacific Edge Magazine's annual Business Achievement Awards. I'm Howard Dushevsky. And I'm Kelly Simek. If you're posting on social media tonight, be sure to use the hashtag PEMGala2020 and tag Pacific Edge Magazine on Instagram or Facebook. There's also a Best Dress Contest running tonight on Instagram, and all you have to do is post a photo before midnight tonight of what you're wearing for tonight's gala and make sure to tag Pacific Edge. There will be two winners, one male and one female, each receiving a $100 gift card to Watanabe Floral. Winners will be announced on Instagram tomorrow and they will be judged by the Pacific Edge team based on creativity and the best gala themed right. outfit. Very cool. Now before we get going, we want to start off by thanking all of our incredible judges. Aloha, I'm Christina Lockwood from KHON2 and I just want to say we're so honored to be part of the Pacific Edge Business Achievement Awards in 2020 and as one of the judges, we were so impressed, all of the judges, with all of the participants. So congratulations to all of the nominees and the winners for this year's Pacific Edge Business Achievement Awards. Thank you to Toby Tamaye, Jacob No, Lisa Maruyama, John Strandberg, Joy Barua, and Mariah Brown, of course, Christina Lockwood as well, for their time and effort in choosing the finalists and winners. And now let's hear from Pacific Edge Magazine's founder and publisher, Naomi Hazelton. Aloha! Tonight we are celebrating 15 years with Pacific Edge Magazine, Hawaii's only business and lifestyle magazine combined. We feature real people with extraordinary lives, their motivation, their inspiration, and their innovation. I am Naomi Hazelton, and I am the publisher and founder of Pacific Edge Magazine. I truly know what it takes to be a woman-owned, family-owned, small business entrepreneur. And let me tell you, the hustle is real. That's why every now and then this Kauai girl heads on over to the boardroom for a meeting with the beautiful Pacific Ocean. In an effort to collaborate quickly and pivot, Pacific Edge Magazine has formed a partnership with KHON2, and this year we have made it our mission to empower local businesses via our multiple media channels in an effort to continue to champion Hawaii's leaders and make it through together these unprecedented times. Let us continue to hold true to our values and our cultures. We are all in this together. Let's stay strong, Hawaii. Let's unite and let's all stay focused and positive. A huge congratulations to all the finalists. You are all winners and amazing individuals. And a short and quick sweet shout out to my Kauai Ohana, my friends and all of you watching. Have a wonderful, wonderful evening. And now let's get to the gala. Now we wouldn't be here tonight if it wasn't for our presenting sponsors who made tonight's event possible. So we offer a thank you to The Cliffs at Princeville, Securitas Security Services, English Hong Architecture, St. Louis School, Guaranteed Rate, Project Vision Hawaii, Outrigger Hotels and Resorts, First Hawaiian Bank, St. Francis Healthcare System, Watanabe Floral, Chamber of Commerce Hawaii, Better Business Bureau, and Green Building Hawaii, Volta Charging, and Revolution Smart Home, proud clean energy allies with Hawaii Energy. We thank you all for supporting this event and the businesses and professionals who are all there enjoying watching tonight. So are you ready to get going? Yes, let's begin. All right, let's do this. Our first awards of the evening, the Lifetime Achievement Awards, sponsored by Project Vision Hawaii. Hawaii Eye Foundation recently merged with Project Vision Hawaii to focus on increasing local and international access to better health care. The Lifetime Achievement Award honors someone who has repeatedly gone above and beyond the standard obligations in their industry while also significantly contributing to the local business community during their professional career. It is my honor to announce that this year's Lifetime Achievement Award recipient is 
Jim Walter, CEO of Hawaiian Building Maintenance. Yep, for over 25 years now, Jim Walters has been the CEO for Hawaiian Building Maintenance, and under his leadership, the company has more than doubled. Jim has drive to provide first-class service to hundreds of facilities across the state while creating a lasting impact through his charitable work for numerous local nonprofits. Thank you very much, Pacific Edge Magazine, Element Media, and Naomi for this Lifetime Achievement Award. 26 years ago, our family moved from Oklahoma to Hawaii. And for me, it's been the greatest blessing in my life to be part of this local community. I'd like to also thank Oliver Ohana at HBM for all that they do each day, and also for all of those charities that I've been involved in, for their hard work, for those who are less fortunate. Again, thank you, mahalo and aloha. The second award in our program is the Commitment to Green Award, sponsored by Green Building Hawaii, a proud clean energy ally with Hawaii Energy. Green Building Hawaii provides sustainability focused consulting and training for architects, builders, and developers, and their services include energy management, green building certifications, and building performance testing. The Commitment to Green Award honors an individual or business that has shown a commitment to sustainable green living by promoting education and training, advocating green lawmaking and policies at the legislative level, engaging in green practices within their own organization, creating, sustaining, or promoting programs in response to environmental issues, or developing, implementing, or sponsoring green events to get their local community involved. Okay, that's a lot. So now <laughs> let's get to them, the finalists. Danielle Bass, State Sustainability Coordinator, State of Hawaii, Office of Planning. FOG Safe, LLC. And we also have in this category, the Managing Director, Melissa Miyashiro, Director of Strategy and Policy at Blue Planet Foundation. Outrigger Hospitality Group, Outrigger's Zone, and the winner of the Pacific Edges Magazine's Commitment to Green Award is Melissa Miyashiro, Managing Director of Strategy and Policy at the Blue Planet Foundation. Thank you to Pacific Edge Magazine and the judges for this award. It really means a lot to me because caring for the planet and the people and creatures that call it home is near and dear to my heart. I'd like to recognize the incredible team that I work with and I can't wait to see what we accomplish next together. Mahalo. All right, our next award is one that was added only a couple of years ago in honor of Pacific Edge Magazine's third annual Women in Business issue, dedicated to recognizing some of our community's most hardworking, high-powered women. We will now present the Business Woman of the Year, that award sponsored by Guaranteed Rate. As a mortgage company, Guaranteed Rate places their clients' needs first while caring for the community and empowering women through their GROW program. The Business Woman of the Year Award honors a woman who has had a positive impact on their organization, cause, or industry through effective leadership and a demonstrated commitment to innovation and business excellence. Okay, here we go. The finalists are Monica Bells, President and CEO of Kauai Government Employees Federal Credit Union. Also, Trisha Fatui, Senior Director of Events and Management and Executive Director of the Young Professionals Program at Chamber of Commerce Hawaii. Tracy Lawson, President and Founder of Lawson & Associates, Inc. Terry Orton, General Manager of Hawaii Convention Center. And the winner of the Pacific Edge Magazine's 2020 Business Woman of the Year is Tracy Lawson, President and Founder of Lawson & Associates, Inc. Aloha. Thank you to Pacific Edge Magazine and the judges for this award. I'd like to say a special thank you to Nalani Jenkins, my partner and chief operating officer for her support and strength in helping us walk out our dreams in some pretty tough times. To the team at Lawson, thank you for helping us level up. It's a Kako thing. We look forward to our future at the Safety Intelligence Institute and walking out our 2030 vision to make Hawaii safer and more prosperous for everyone. Woo, yeah. Our next award is the Nonprofit Impact of the Year. This award honors an outstanding Hawaii nonprofit organization for a specific program, activity, initiative, or accomplishment that has had a profound impact on the community. The winner of this award continually seeks to measure and improve their services to the community while also providing exceptional service and leadership. All right, let's look at the first finalist beginning with the Blood Bank of Hawaii. 
also the Institute for Human Services, the Legal Aid Society of Hawaii, and Touch a Heart Inc. And the winner of Pacific Edge Magazine's 2020 Nonprofit Impact of the Year is the Blood Bank of Hawaii. Aloha and mahalo to Pacific Edge Magazine for this honor and congratulations to all nominees. Blood Bank is thrilled and honored to receive this award, but it really belongs to all of our blood donors, especially our COVID-19 plasma donors, to our staff and Hawaii CCP Coalition, who really came through for the people of Hawaii. Blood can only come from donors, so we really rely on each other. On behalf of Blood Bank of Hawaii and the hospitals we serve, thank you. Aloha, I'm Monica Bells, CEO of Kauai Government Employees Federal Credit Union, joining you from our new branch in Kilauea. We started as a Kauai-owned credit union in 1947, and our roots go even deeper to the Kalo farmers, fishermen, and pioneers who have called this island home for generations. In times like these, our ability to provide for our community is critical. We've supported hundreds of businesses since this pandemic began, and we intend to continue to invest, to grow our quality of life, and to show the world what one small credit union on one small island can do. Mahalo Pacific Edge for shining a light on our story. Together we make it happen at KGFCU. Next award is one that the public got to participate in this year via voting on Instagram and Pacific Edges Awards website. It is the Social Media Influencer of the Year Award sponsored by Volta Charging, a proud clean energy ally with Hawaii Energy. Volta Charging's award-winning charging stations benefit brands, consumers, and real estate locations by providing valuable advertising space to businesses and free electric vehicle charging to drivers. That's right, social media has revolutionized not only marketing and business, but also created new opportunities for influencers. So this award honors those individuals who has utilized the social media successfully and tracked the impact of their social media marketing on the growth of their brand. All right, let's take a look at our four finalists, beginning with Diana Ko, anchor and reporter at KITV4, Abe McCulton, Senior Wish and Content Coordinator at Make-A-Wish Hawaii, Charlie Tekshira, owner of Route 99 and Acts of Aloha, and Kai Tran, Realtor Associate at Caldwell Banker Realty. And the winner of Pacific Edge Magazine's Social Media Influencer of the Year Award is Kai Tran, Realtor Associate at Caldwell Banker Hawaii. Kai Tran skillfully curates content for his social media platforms to speak to his audience and followers in a way that will engage and interest them. He focuses on lifestyle posts while maintaining a high standard of professionalism. Social media has anchored his business in new development condominium projects, and he focuses 85% to 90% of his marketing on social media. Like the Social Media Influencer of the Year Award, the public also got to have a say in our next award, which honors the Social Media Business Impact of the Year, sponsored by the Cliffs at Princeville. Ah, beautiful place, 22 lush acres. The Cliffs of Princeville is a protected enclave of spacious one and two bedroom solar powered units overlooking Kauai's majestic North Shore. And as we all know, social media has been really transforming the realm of marketing and becoming an integral part of companies' communication strategies. The Social Media Business Impact of the Year honors those organizations that have effectively utilized social media to grow their presence and brand in the online community. The finalists for the Social Media Business Impact of the Year are Fused Hawaii, Hawaii Food Reviews, Kira Hawaii, and KITV4. And the Pacific Edge Magazine's Social Media Business Impact of the Year person is... Kira Hawaii. Hi everyone, thank you so much for voting for us for our Social Media Business Impact of the Year. Just wanna hand this award straight back to all of our fans and followers because we would not be here today had it not been for you guys. So thank you so much from the bottom of my heart. We love and appreciate each and every one of you. Just wanna send you guys kisses. It's totally okay. It's virtual kisses so you will not get the corona. And just wanna say, 
congratulations to all of this year's nominees and a huge mahalo to Pacific Edge for continuing to put on this event because we could all use a dose of positive vibes right now. So thank you so much. Sending all my love and aloha. Thank you. Health is something that's been on everybody's mind this year and our next award recognizes the Healthcare Leader of the Year sponsored by St. Francis Healthcare System of Hawaii. St. Francis Healthcare System of Hawaii is proud to create healthy communities and serve as the sponsor of Pacific Edge Magazine's Healthcare Leader of the Year Award. The award honors an individual within Hawaii's healthcare industry who has helped to deliver results and steer change by taking innovative ideas forward or implementing a practice-based service that has benefited the local community. Okay, here we go. The finalists for this award are Janan Bana, CEO of Janan Bana LLC. Shelly Wilson, president of Wilson Care Group and AlohaMass.com, and David Yu, owner and medical director of Aesthetics Hawaii. And Pacific Edge Magazine's Healthcare Leader of the Year is Shelly Wilson, president of Wilson Care Group and AlohaMask.com. In January 2020, hearing about PPE shortages on the mainland and around the world, Shelly Wilson began purchasing PPE for her nurses and caregivers, administrative staff, and fellow healthcare professionals. Soon after, she created two companies to help supply much needed PPE to the people of Hawaii, as well as Mission First Responders, a charity initiative to donate PPE to frontline first responders and medical professionals assisting over 1,000 business organizations and agencies throughout the state of Hawaii. Our next award is the Hospitality Executive of the Year Award, sponsored by Outrigger Hotels and Resorts. That's right, Outrigger Hotels and Resorts, the premier beach resort brand in the world with authentic and iconic resorts across Hawaii, Fiji, Thailand, Mauritius, and the Maldives. Now this award honors a hospitality executive whose skill, foresight, agility, and vision have enabled them to navigate their business or organization through the very changing times we've been seeing while making a positive contribution to Hawaii's critically important hospitality industry. Our finalists are Jim Brayman, General Manager of the Cliffs at Princeville, Simeon Miranda, General Manager of Embassy Suites by Hilton Waikiki Beach Walk, and Terry Orton, General Manager of Hawaii Convention Center. And the winner is, or should I say the winners are, because for the first time in awards history, there's a tie. The 2020 Hospitality Executives of the Year are Terry Orton, General Manager of the Hawaii Convention Center, and Jim Brayman, GM of the beautiful Cliffs at Princeville. With over 25 years of hospitality experience, Terry Orton oversees the Hawaii Convention Center as General Manager. During the COVID-19 pandemic, she has been instrumental in guiding Hawaii Convention Center through a particularly challenging time with no meetings and events. She helped implement a state-of-the-art health and safety program, developed a plan on how to best use the center, and created a detailed reopening plan. And as general manager of the Cliffs of Princeville, Jim Brayman has been a driving force for adherence to documented standards of excellence. His focus on quality and continuous improvement has allowed the Cliffs at Princeville to achieve premier resort status. Jim's efforts have inspired others to put their best effort forward and create an environment where owners and guests can view the cliffs at Princeville as their second home. Congratulations to you both, Terry and Jim. Our next award is Business Executive of the Year, sponsored by St. Louis School. St. Louis School is the only all-boys school in Hawaii, offering a college preparatory education to students in grades K through 12. This award honors an executive who has had an immensely positive impact on their organization through innovation, integrity, and growth while pushing their company to excellence throughout every aspect of the business. Our finalists are Monica Bell, President and CEO, Kauai Government Employees Federal Credit Union, Tiara Covington, President, Integrated Facility Services, Hawaii. Also, Tracy Lawson, President and Founder, Lawson and Associates, Inc., and Kuhio Lewis, CEO of the Council for Native Hawaiian Advancement. Thank you to all four of our finalists. And the winner of Pacific Edge Magazine's Business Executive of the Year Award is... Monica Bells, President and CEO of Kauai Government Employees Federal Credit Union. Thank you, Pacific Edge Magazine and judges for this awesome award. I would like to recognize my team who have been true heroes throughout this tough year. We're looking forward to 2021 and the exciting projects to come. Mahalo. 
At Revolusun, we specialize in not only making our home more efficient, but also making it more comfortable. From brand new installations to servicing and replacing of existing units, Revolusun smart home specialists will work with you to provide an AC system perfect for your home. A Mitsubishi Diamond Contractor featuring the best warranties available. Be assured your AC unit will keep you cool for years to come. Call us today at 748-8888. Revolusun, cleaner, smarter, living. You live life on the go, and now so does your mortgage application with FHB Digital. It's easy and fast with features that gather your documents or make it simple to upload them yourself. FHB Digital provides personalized mortgage options to suit your budget. And if you have questions, just ask a loan officer. FHB Digital. Bank at the speed of your life with First Hawaiian Bank. Don't stop playing just because you grow up. Stay at the top of your game with St. Francis Healthcare System. Live every moment. Two out of three. Like many companies this year, Pacific Edge Magazine pivoted their business by increasing their online presence and supporting local business through social media channels. Our next award honors companies who have also adapted their business to a new marketplace. Introducing another new addition to this year's awards, the Business Pivot of the Year Award, sponsored by First Hawaiian Bank. And we know in this year of COVID, so many businesses have been forced to pivot. Right. First Hawaiian Bank is Hawaii's largest and oldest financial institution, offering a comprehensive suite of banking services to customers and businesses alike. And it all starts with a yes. yes. All right, now this award honors a business that has pivoted their skills to meet the new societal needs, again, that have emerged as a result of the pandemic via new products and services in Hawaii. Our finalists are JPG Hawaii, Kohana Distillers, Kufu Spirits by Maui Brewing Company, Wilson Care Group, and AlohaMass.com. And the winner of Pacific Edge Magazine's Business Pivot of the Year is JPG Hawaii. With local roots and global reach, JPG has been serving Hawaii businesses since the year 2000. JPEG would like to thank Pacific Edge Magazine and the judges for this award. We'd like to thank our incredible team. Together, we had an amazing year. We're looking forward to 2021 and some exciting new projects in the future. Mahalo. Mahalo, Hawaii. All right, our next award recognizing this year's best new business sponsored by Revolution Smart Home, a proud clean energy ally with Hawaii Energy. Revolution Smart Home has revolutionized residential solar in Hawaii, earning the trust in business of thousands, as well as the reputation of Hawaii's most trusted solar. New businesses emerge in Hawaii regularly. Nominees in this category have set themselves apart, not only with their product or service, but also through their innovation, marketing, good business practices, and a commitment to the community, making them front runners in their field. This award recognizes the companies that have been businesses for no more than three years. And the finalists are Hale Partners, Kapa Nui Nails, Kokua Sun Care, Punaheli Provisions, and the winner of Pacific Edge Magazine's Best New Business Award is Kokua Sun Care. Aloha, everyone. Thank you so much for picking Kokua Sun Care as the best new Hawaii business. Thank you to Pacific Edge Magazine and the judges. This is such an honor to receive this award. And thank you to our fans and friends who supported and encouraged us along the way. This means so much. Yeah, we couldn't have done it without you all. And don't forget that the January 1st, the new safe sunscreen law goes into effect. No chemical sunscreens in Hawaii's ocean. So pick something with zinc, please. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> This next award is a personal favorite. It's the Best Family-Run Business Award sponsored by Securitas Security Services. And Securitas is the largest security provider in the state offering guarding services, mobile patrols, access control, remote video monitoring, alarm response, and temporary services. This award honors an outstanding company that has successfully merged family and business interests, incorporating active collaboration across generations, 
remaining true to their background and heritage, and committing themselves to reinforcing core family values into a successful business model. All right, here we go. Our finalists are Hawaiian Building Maintenance, JPG Hawaii, Popeyes Hawaii, and Smith's Motorboat Services. And the winner of Pacific Edge Magazine's Best Family Run Business Award is... Hawaiian Building Maintenance. Thank you Pacific Edge Magazine and the judges for this incredible award. We're so thankful for the amazing team at HBM for all that we accomplished during this very challenging year. We're really excited for 2021 and all that's ahead. And again, thank you, this is awesome. Recognizing the most innovative, cutting edge young individuals in the marketplace, our final award of the evening is the Young Professional of the Year Award sponsored by English Hong Architecture. English Hong Architecture is a partnership between Ed English and Chris Hong that works on several project types while currently focusing on financial institutions. This award recognizes a young entrepreneur, business owner, or executive of a local company or organization who has made an impressive impact on their industry while also exemplifying business excellence, community spirit, innovation, and personal integrity. Okay, so here we go. Tonight's finalists are inspirations to their colleagues as well as to their fellow young professionals and entrepreneurs in the local business community. And our finalists are Kristen Hun, Marketing Manager at Honolulu Federal Credit Union, Jacob Johnson, RME and partner at Holly Partners, LLC. Bianca Mortesini, Senior Director of Alumni Engagement at the University of Hawaii Ma'anoa's Scheidler College of Business. And Ethan West, Co-Founder and President of Punahele Provisions. And Pacific Edge Magazine's 2020 Young Professional of the Year is Ethan West, Co-Founder and President of Punahele Provisions. Thank you to Pacific Edge Magazine and the panel of judges for selecting me as Young Professional of the Year. My father taught me that you are a direct reflection of the people and causes that you surround yourself with. I'm honored to have trust instilled in me by this community to represent my friends, my family, and our community partners all across Hawaii and beyond. We're excited for the work that we're doing at Punahele Commissions and can't wait to share it with you. So once again, thank you all and a lot. Wow, such a great evening. Big congratulations to all of tonight's finalists and award recipients. And thank you for your innovation, service, commitment, and everything you do to make Hawaii one of the most incredible places in the world. We wish you all the best. Absolutely. And before we conclude our presentation tonight, again, I want to extend a huge mahalo to all of our sponsors. The Cliffs of Princeville, Securitas Security Services, English Hong Architecture, St. Louis School, Guaranteed Rate, Project Vision Hawaii, Outrigger Hotels and Resorts, First Hawaiian Bank, St. Francis Healthcare System, Watanabe Floral, Chamber of Commerce Hawaii, Better Business Bureau, and Green Building Hawaii, Voltage Charging and Revolution Smart Home, proud clean energy allies with Hawaii Energy. And before we end, we kindly ask that you post a photo of your gala experience tonight on Instagram and use the hashtag PEMGala2020. Mahalo again for tuning in and see you again next year. Remember, all of you are winners. Good night. <laughs>